What's going on YouTube? I am back with another video and in this one we are headed to a local show here in the Louisville, Kentucky area. So today is actually the perfect day for a show because I don't know if you guys can see uh, outside behind me. It is a very, very gloomy, muggy day here in Louisville. So perfect day to head to a car show. So uh, excited to uh, see what the show has to offer. So it's been I want to say two or three months since we've actually had this particular show. So this is the one that's actually uh, inside of a hotel. Uh, the other one, the J&J &J show, uh, that one has been occurring every month. So definitely interested to see how this show is. Again, it's been a few months. I think the it was supposed to happen a month or two ago and the last one got canceled for some reason. So been a little while. Definitely interested to see you know the amount of dealers, the turnout. I know it's kind of the market's kind of weird right now. So uh, yeah, excited to see what this show has to offer. You guys already know the drill. You know what I'm looking for. I'm looking for stuff for the uh, mystery packs on the Card Shop Live, as well as the uh, national fire packs. So those are the main two objectives. I'm gonna go ahead and head over to the ATM and get some cash, and then we're gonna head on to the show. So I'll check back in along the way. All right guys, so we just stopped by the ATM, got our cash, we are ready to go. So we're heading on to the show right now. We're actually pretty early, the show starts at nine. It's only about 8.20 right now, so I should be at the show pretty early. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you guys when we get there. All right guys, so just made it to the show. It is a little bit after 8.30. Again, the show does start at nine, so a little bit early. Uh, probably a little bit earlier than I usually get to these shows, so uh, excited to uh, hopefully get first dibs at what is in here. I forgot to mention also, I have not seen any Target uh, Prism hanger boxes, so I'm hoping potentially someone in there is selling some Target Prism hanger boxes. I would definitely like to open some of those on the channel. So we're gonna be on the lookout for those as well. Of course, uh, cards for the mystery packs, uh, which will be tomorrow. Actually, when you guys are seeing this video, it's probably gonna be later on this uh, this evening when I will will be live on the Card Shop Live. And then, of course, I am looking for uh, cards for the national fire packs. So let's go ahead and head on in and see what we can find. Against my better judgment, I would do 75 bucks. 75, okay. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it had to be that at one point for me to slap that on there. Right. The market's changed so much. Right. Uh, I'd do 70 for you if you wanted to. 70? Yeah, I'll do that. Okay, I can do 70. You got a 10? Yeah, I got you, bro. All right. I appreciate it. I love that guy. He's he's finally starting to play ball. Yeah, too. Yeah, it's a nice looking card too. I appreciate you, buddy. Yep. Always do, man. Thank you. So have a good day, man. Yeah, you too. Um, would y'all do three hundred on these three? So that'd basically be like sixty and a hundred here, and then two hundred here. And then I'm, I was gonna put the the cam back. <laughs> These are, I'll look these up. These are about like 65 or 70. I meant him. I think what you, no, yeah, I know. I was just saying that's what they're going for. What are you valuing that at? Probably about like 50. Oh, Because yeah, like, like, I didn't know how much you, is that what you have in the long soda? Yeah. Do what? Oh, three school? Okay. Sounds good. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, you don't know, but he's not holding that. Excuse me. He's probably my favorite guy who's not even on top. Who'd you say these were? 60? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna grab one of these. You got the good one, right? 
I don't know. I, I, I think it might be going up for like a giveaway. So okay. <laughs> doesn't really matter to me. So <laughs> I appreciate some good out. I appreciate it. We'll see. I'll What's, the stuff you got for me did pretty well. Uh, what what I get? Uh, I think you got like a Genesis. Of John yeah, Shower that's yeah, like that's that. right, that's yeah. right, yeah. What's your price on the fields? Give me cool comps are. I'll look it up if you don't. Uh, no, I, I haven't looked it up yet. I was just kind of curious. Yeah, yeah, when I pulled it, I thought it was a silver and about put in a $10 box at first. Oh, you pulled that? Yeah. Oh, wow. It's one of the very few cards here I pulled. That's a good one. <laughs> I do 160 on it. There's the... There's the Tops, you can look at them. So that's the very cheapest one. It's two forty. Oh, wow. okay. Two fifty. Gotcha. Have you looked at it at all? I really haven't. You can feel free to. <laughs> okay. I think it might be a great candidate, but I trust your guys better than mine. <laughs> I don't know, man. I if I don't have my magnifying lens, I'm <laughs> not too great. One sixty? Yeah, I'll do that. I feel like that's a pretty pretty solid deal. Yeah, uh, special is great, buddy. <laughs> yeah. One twenty forty and. 60. It should be 160 there. Yes, sir. All right, I appreciate it. I appreciate your uh, Nash, or Tennessee Titans football players yeah. gonna be there. Yeah, it's gonna be huge. Like PSA is gonna be there. Grading is gonna be like. Tennessee. Uh, Nashville. They're on July seventh. It did one hundred five. Okay. Uh, July seventh. You got nine. Oh, ninety. Um, one hundred seven. So it's about a hundred bucks. Yeah. yeah. Let's look up the. So uh, be about seventy-five on that. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I can do that, and then we'll look up the uh, Lamelo. Okay, so what are you what are you thinking on that one then? Well, you said seventy five, mm -hmm. and then did you do fifty? So one twenty five. Mm -hmm. Okay, yep. I can do that. That's perfect. See if I got a. I think I should still have one more five. You Maybe you not. Cash All right, I appreciate it, man. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. Thank you. Sure, somebody will appreciate it. It's a good one. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure, for sure. Yeah, I feel like if uh, you know somebody pulls a Trey Young rookie PSA 10, you gotta be happy about that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there we go. All right. All right, there we go. Shout out to Bread's Cards, everybody. Appreciate it. Appreciate the deal, man. All right, guys, so just walked out of the show. It is almost 11.30, so I was in there quite a while, probably, I guess, close to like three hours. Uh, pleasantly surprised at the turnout. Again, I was uh, kind of wondering how it was gonna be as far as the dealer setup, uh, but I think just about every single table in there uh, had a dealer. There were very, very few open tables, so uh, that was definitely nice, and again, pleasantly surprised with the, uh, the cards. So happy with the pickups. Didn't pick up a ton of cards, I would say probably somewhere around uh, eight to ten cards so definitely some nice ones for the mystery packs and the fire packs and I was actually also able to pick up a couple of these uh, prism blasters from fanatics so I uh, might open one of these at the end of this video when I show the pickup so stay tuned for that and yeah I'm gonna head on home now and show you guys everything that we were able to pick up all right guys, so we have made it back home from the show and we are ready to go ahead and get into all of the pickups. So I'm actually recording this clip the same day as the show. Usually I will record the pickups uh, clip uh, maybe a day or two after the show, but I wanna go ahead and get it knocked out again. Uh, a lot of these cards are gonna be in mystery packs on the Card Shop Live. If you guys are watching this the, the day the video comes out, which is Sunday the 10th, uh, a lot of these cards are gonna be in those mystery packs. So you guys are gonna get a little sneak peek for later on uh, this evening. So I will also say that I have not reviewed the footage from the show yet. Uh, so hopefully that did turn out okay. Uh, kind of the main focus today was just uh, making as many quality pickups as I could. So tried to get some, some decent footage and I know I got some B-roll clips, but hopefully 
uh, you know, overall the footage turned out okay and you guys did enjoy the show video. Uh, I was very pleased with the turnout. Again, wasn't too sure what to expect. It was definitely a rainy day. Uh, it's getting close to the national. The market is kind of down right now. So wasn't sure what to expect, but overall very, very pleased. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into these pickups. Of course, you guys have seen the Prism Fanatics Blaster already. Probably going to open one of those uh, at the end here. So stay tuned for that. Uh, so let's go ahead and get into it. Shout out to Bread's Cards, uh, Braden, for the T-Law Red, White, and Blue. Got a good deal on that one. I believe $45 on this one. So this one will be in the mystery packs. And I guess I'll go ahead and show the next one as well. These will probably probably be bundled together. Um, so price on the Contenders Optic T-Law was 30, ended up getting that for 20. So pretty decent deals on these two T-Laws. And uh, yeah, probably be a bundle deal there. So that will be in one mystery pack. And then next up we have a Luis Robert. This one is the Topps Chrome Pink PSA 10. So uh, again, I do really enjoy putting together these mystery packs because it's not just basketball. I enjoy kind of searching for deals on all sports. Definitely a lot easier to, to make pickups for these as well, rather than just the fire packs uh, where I'm uh, very, very picky on the fire packs. So I uh, got a nice baseball uh, card here, Luis Robert PSA 10. And then next up, I'll go ahead and show these two at the same time. I did pick these up from um, a guy who's been in my subs before. He wasn't actually set up at the show. Uh, we had kind of made a deal on Instagram and he uh, was gonna be at the show. So I went ahead and picked these up from him. We got the uh, Trey Young Prism Rookie PSA 10 and a Lamello Donruss PSA 10. So I'm gonna save the Trey for the fire packs got the tray for 75 dollars which is a really really good deal these are about 100 bucks and he said that he was you know willing to do about 70 to 80 percent of ebay so definitely appreciate the deal and then we got the lamello donruss psa 10 i believe the price we did on this one was 50. this one is going to go in the mystery packs on the card at shop live so i'm not going to save this one for the uh, fire packs this one's probably going to go mystery packs and then next up the biggest pickup of the show we have a Juan Soto, clearly authentic. This one is an on-card auto, kind of hard to see, uh, but it is it is an on-card auto. It is a mini, so as you, you guys can <laughs> tell, that's not the normal size card. It is a mini, and it is going to be numbered 46 of 99. So thought this one would be a really, really nice baseball chase card. That's kind of what I want to do going forward. I like to have three chase cards in each series, and I really wanna do one baseball, one basketball, and one football chase card. So this is gonna be the big one for baseball. Uh, this one is around like 200 to 225, the value on the Juan Soto. So that would definitely be a nice one there. And then, oh, and I did get, I guess I'll go ahead and show all these three together. I did get these from Connor with uh, Connor's and one cards on IG. I'll, you guys will probably see a couple clips of their table um, in previous footage, uh, but just want to mention that. That's where I got these from. And then we got the Aaron Rodgers Masquerade Ballers case hit out of Mosaic. And these are just, for case hits, these are just super, super cheap. Uh, it was about 40 bucks on the Aaron Rodgers. And then we got the Luca PSA 10 Center Stage. This one, I am going to save this one for the National Fire Pack. So this one and the Trey Young are the only two that I did pick up for the National Packs. And then the big football chase card. This is definitely my favorite pickup of the show. Got a really, really good deal on this one. So we got a Justin Fields NFL debut mosaic honeycomb. And um, I have not looked at this one like under a magnifying lens, but just to the naked eye, it looks super, super clean. Probably a really, really solid grading candidate. Uh, the price on these was anywhere from like 200 to 250. Ended up getting this from for 160 so incredible deal on the justin fields and i do think you know just with the naked eye i do think it is a strong grading candidate so probably going to be the football chase card uh so we got the football chase card the uh, baseball chase card and then um not really sure what i'm going to use for the basketball chase card yet kind of you know, making some last minute additions and, and still working everything out. So we'll see what happens, but you guys will know what the three chasers are ahead of time. 
uh, if you guys do check out the uh, the live stream tomorrow. So that does it for the pickups from the card show today. Very happy with those. And now I do think we will go ahead and rip into a Prism Fanatics uh, blaster box. Have not opened any of these. This is the first time that I'm opening some Prism Fanatics. Uh, have entered in all of the raffles on the Fanatics website and have never won a single time. So um, price wasn't too bad on these. I got uh, two of these blasters for $55. So we'll see what we can have, see what we can pull. We are looking for those two um, rookie orange ice prism. So hopefully we can get a top uh, rookie QB. And I don't think, yeah, it says look for blaster exclusive mem cards. So you cannot get autos out of here, I don't believe. So let's go ahead and get into this pack or get into this blaster and see what we can pull. All right, so we have Nick Bosa, Michael Gallup. Our rookie is Ambry Thomas. And we are going to start with a Plaxico Burr as well. I crack up every time I pull a Plaxico card. It's just so random. Uh, last time I heard anything about him, he was, I think he shot himself in the leg. So we have a silver in here. This is going to be our one silver. Uh, Mark Brunel, Aaron Jones. And of course, it's not going to be a rookie. That is Derwin James and Brilliance Aaron Rodgers. All right, next pack, I think we got a kid reporter back here. Uh, we have Steve Largent, Devin White, Amari Rodgers, our first rookie, looks either red or orange, maybe Bengals. Uh, that says, oh, 49ers, can we see Trey Lance? We cannot, <laughs> of course, it's gonna be Trey Sermon on the orange cracked ice. Uh, that would have been very, very nice if that was a Trey Lance. But I'll take a Trey Sermon. Could certainly be worse than that. Uh, Tua, Legereus Sneed. We're gonna have Dion Jones. And that is gonna be Darius Leonard. So we have two more packs. We have DK, Baker, Kyle Trask, and it looks like we're gonna have a rookie in our last pack, Jamie Collins. So let's see what our other rookie orange ice is. Hopefully we did not get shorted a rookie. So we have James White, Jordan Poyer, uh, Gross Matos, and ooh, looks like Dolphins. Hopefully it's not Panthers. And ooh, it is Jags. Or I said Dolphins. I'm, I was hoping for Jags. Uh, so let's see what we have. No. <laughs> Jalen Camp. So, of course, we didn't pull Trevor Lawrence. We didn't pull Trey Lance. We've got Trey Sermon and Jalen Camp instead. So uh, the classic Prism troll. Uh, what are you going to do? That's just how it goes with this year's Prism. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this show video. And I will see you soon.